Also, strong storms sweeping through the metro overnight. The high winds doing some major damage at the airport. And also to homes and businesses in the south part of the metro. News 4's Emily Akins has details. Some major damage at this strip mall here in Dell City. You can see where boards are scattered all over the walkway here. Many of them have nails sticking out, making this very dangerous for people. Now, we did speak with one of the business owners, and she tells us she's just glad nobody was inside when this happened. When I got here, I was thinking, oh my God, that's a tornado. Cheryl Jackson describing what she saw after pulling up to her business around 1 o'clock Friday morning. Jackson later learning it wasn't a tornado, instead straight line winds over 70 miles per hour that ripped the roof off of this strip mall and her two shops. When I walked in there, was so much water, and then they told us not to walk back in there because the power lines on top of this new problem jackson says it's already been a hard year for local businesses it's been a tough year we were just getting ready to open back up but she's leaning on her faith thankful that nobody was hurt it's not going to rain forever and I, I believe everything happens for a reason. Over 10 miles away in southwest Oklahoma City, the Dream Center dealing with similar damage. Their roof. It's going to look like probably total loss. Gone and their space filled with water. You can see night sky in the upstairs. Now asking for the public's help. We, we need any kind of help that we can get, especially from organizations that are willing to donate. You know, that would be the best. Emily Akins, Oklahoma's News 4. All right, Emily, thank you. Now in Dell City, that shop owner telling us OGE was called out to turn the power off. She told us there's not a timeline right now for how long repairs might take.